Well, Ricky, well done. You're through to the next round, but it was a funny, topsy-turvy sort of match, that one. Yeah, a bit of a struggle, really. Um, both struggled out there from the start, to be honest, and none of us could get a grip on the game. I managed to sort of get the middle part of the game uh, under my belt and then sort of mark come back as well, so I finished off strong in the end. Topsy-turvy. Well, you had to dig deep in the decider after he'd brought things back all square, but were you surprised at how patchy his form was in the match? Because he said in his uh, post-match press conference that he reckons that was a one of the worst performances he's produced in 20 years of being a pro. Yeah, he missed a lot of balls early on. Um, I did too, to be honest, and it was sort of going that way. The whole match sort of went down that avenue, really, where we were both struggling. And um, I just think it's one of them. You can, you can sort of, that can happen, really, when you're, both, when you're both out there under a little bit of pressure and stuff, and, and it did today. So it's almost a case of you dragging each other down. Yeah, definitely. You sort of need somebody to get on a roll, really, and, and start potting a few balls, and none of us could do that, and it was a bit of a struggle, so... No, it was, um, it's just one of them that you're just pleased to be through, really, from my point of view, and, and still batting, finished off strong. Well, you finished off incredibly strong, a, a fantastic break. That must give you good confidence and a little bit of self-belief heading into the next round. Yeah, definitely. My game is in good shape, really. It's just a case of um, sticking in there and, and, and playing, playing well. And obviously, when you are struggling, just to get in the next round, which I've done today. So, no, I'm pleased. Fergal O'Brien or Ding, I guess on paper you'd prefer to play Fergal because Ding has won three back-to-back -back ranking events this year. But a bit of a cliche, but there aren't any easy matches at the UK Championship, especially not with this new 1-2-8 format. Yeah, no, obviously you've got favourites in the matches and stuff, but no, there's a lot of, um, there's a lot of surprises going up there as well. So whoever I play, I'll, I'm feeling confident of going through and it'll be a tough challenge. And you've got a little bit of a cold. Has, has that been hanging around for a few days or are you, are you just on the other side of it? Just on the other side now, really. I've just had a couple of days um, just feeling a bit bit groggy you know but no, I'm not too bad just um, hopefully I can have a few more games where I can I can get myself fully out of it you know well I'll get a few lem sips and uh, we'll see you in the next round well done thanks very much thank you cheers I am a champion